Hi, hello, and welcome to something a little bit different here. This is Mine Ward, which from what I get is a dungeon crawler RPG server, which just sounds freaking awesome. You guys know me, or if you don't, I love stuff like this. I love dungeons, I love RPG-like stuff, I love all of that. I've already kind of flicked through the menus and looked through most of the stuff, which you can also do. A lot of it I'm not going to touch right now. We're going to just start our adventure here. Hey, how's it going? Quest. You must be new here. I strongly recommend following your main quest first. How? All right, how do I do my quest? You can find them in your menu in your last hotbar slot, or by speaking to me. Do I get some free gear? I sure hope so. Oh, hi, you must be new here. Yeah, yes, I'd like to join the Mine Ward Legion. Now minding my own business. Yes, that's what I'd like to do. I'm afraid you'll need to, some better gear for that, my dear. Well, okay. I recommend the wolf armor. Get some materials by killing Vargas? V that, v yep. Sorry, darling, but I don't serve refreshments to everyone. You'll need to prove yourself first. Are you fucking kidding me? How do you even make money? Bam! Our goal is to kill Verg Ver that, Ver that guy. Can I steal this? Nope. Hey, guys. Can I... Are you going to be easy to kill? Okay, not a problem. I'm sure this is going to get a lot harder as we go along. Upgrade your class focus and menu to boost your damage. I will definitely have to do that when I get a chance. What's, what's this do? What, what does it do? Ah! It's an invisible mob! I don't know what you do, but I'm killing you! That's for damn sure. I want to lean into this. Okay, so we got the, the warrior set up. But how do I upgrade it? It did say I could upgrade it, right? I don't really need to keep fighting you guys. I mean, I do need more of these things, don't I? So I should probably get them before I go fight the next guy. So, oh, hello. Oh, the, no, I needed the wolf fur. Which I just got my first bit of wolf fur. Oh, boy. Let's be the boss, and uh, we'll just see what happens. I'm here to fight you, punk. Yeah, what the hell? I'm, okay, what are you? Oh, oh, I was really low. Okay, I gotta kite him around a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Couldn't fully kill him. With melee, that gave me one wolf fur, so that's good. <laughs> Should have been there, man. It was insane, dude. Oh my god. Hey, I can get fully healed. Point. Oh. Okay, so that's like an upgrade for the armor. Interesting. You don't have enough levels to. That requires level four. And even though I don't know what you do, I'm still gonna kill you guys. Because I need you to die for me. Yeah, I think the combination of magic and, and melee is gonna be my, my route. Because there's nothing that says I can't do that, it's just not as efficient if I do that. So far, I'm liking what the server has to offer. Like, this is... I don't know how new it is, but, like, for what it's got going on so far, it's pretty damn cool. I'm still trying to figure out, is there actually a way I can level stuff up? Because it keeps telling me to level up my class focus. Uh, okay, I think maybe that's it. Oh, my God. Oh, I see. I'm gonna be able to kill you with my melee now. Like, very easily, bro. Very easily. So, I can go ahead and upgrade the full gear. Now, there is also the option of, um... Continuing the run, start a new run. For each run of the same dungeon in a row, you get bonus experience and bonus luck. Stacks up to 10 times. But I want to go ahead and upgrade my gear. So I can make this and I can make this, which I can go ahead and equip for even more stats. I do have wolf canines. You know what? Let's make this. So how does this work? Okay. So that gives me uh, more melee damage and more nourishment. Great job, my dear. Please take this orcish axe. Speak to me again for your recruitment quest of the mine. Okay. I will need you to slay Skara the Conjurer. Beware, it won't be easy. Where do I find Skara? I'll uh, I'll do that. Can I speak to you now? Can I get something to drink? No. Oh, man. All right. Well, what does this do? Uh, attack damage of six. 100% melee damage. Uh oh. And it has an ability. Crouch left click stuns the target, making it immobile for 2.5 seconds. I got what I need. I ain't no punk. Hey, what you guys got? One shot, bozo. One shot, bozo. You're gonna take a lot more hits, huh? I mean, yeah, but you're still punks. I'm just saying. Oh my god, yeah, def- Oh, never mind, never mind. Not a punk, not a punk, not a punk. Okay, do I do a, a heckin' climb up this shit? Oh boy, I'm excited, right? You look actually kind of weak. Oh, okay, 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 okay. My bad, my bad, my bad. Does he- He does go and beat their ass. That is hilarious. Wait. He's gonna go beat his ass. Get him, bud! Beat him up for me! I'm pretty sure I have to kill this guy to move on. Oh, wait, maybe I don't. I hope not, because he's just gone. Actually, he's up there. Hey, I see- Oh, no, that's a different guy. Yeah, we're getting into some serious fights. A potato? Can I sell that? Can I do anything with the potato? I need a, I need something to heal me. Like, I definitely need some kind of a heal or else I'm gonna die. Although, I'm pretty sure these dungeons are built for, like, up to two players maximum, 
which I actually really like because personally, I don't really like the idea of having to get a full group together, it, even if it's just randoms. It just doesn't doesn't really strike my fancy as much as a dungeon I can definitely handle alone. You know, uh, Prince Leo was right. This was not going to be easy. Oh, I'm dead. I was not prepared. I got a Stoneheart Sledgehammer. I need to regenerate some HP for a bit. So if you guys could just chill over there. Actually, I can go and kill the Iron Golems. I just need you all to die. I just need you all to die. Die, 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 die. Ah! Dead! Ah, tomb cleared. I've done it. Holy shit. Oh, I need to do it one more time for the full set. Oh, man, I kind of want to. But before I do that, there is a reason to run these again. You level up your two mastery at 10, 50, 100, 250, and 1,000 runs. Each mastery level awards plus five bonus locks against enemies uh, of that tomb and plus bonus locks anywhere. As you've slaughtered the Conjurer, you are now officially the recruit of the Mine Ward Legion. Take this sigil and apply it on your equipment menu when you are ready for your next quest. Talk to me. Oh, this is a jewelry thing. So we would go to this, we would go to equipment, and then it would go in there. Sigil of Honor, that gives us plus five HP, and I think I can take it out anytime I want to, which is good. Can I finally talk to you? Have I earned it? Ah, fuck. The depths of the Sarah Tombs have much more to offer than you realize. And go to Forge, craft either a full set of Stone Golem, which is for melee. Ah, I see. Stray, which is uh for archery. And Necromancer for magic and come back. Okay, so let's go check out the tomb. Ow, 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 ow. Please, I just need some cast iron. Mm, no cast iron, that's unfortunate. Here we go, this is the last bit of spawn. So if I don't get the cast iron now, I don't... I mean, I could run it again, I think I will. Oh god. No, you're closing off my exits! Ah, oh, shit! Come on, give me the cast iron. Oh, we got it, we got the cast iron, let's go! I thought I was going to have to run it a third time. Well, technically a fourth time, because I did die the, the first time. Ow. What the hell? Where the fuck? Oh, yeah, I forgot you were in this. Where the... Why? Why now? So that gives me... It doesn't have a set bonus, but I think it's better overall, because you can see now I've got a 32% crit chance. That's better than, than what I had, 20. I'm here to upgrade to the... Uh, can I actually see what it does? 150% melee damage. Sun's target making them immobile for 3.5 seconds has a 12 second cooldown. Bop. Better axe. Hey, Leo, I got the armor. Oh, let me heal. 95 HP. I'm gonna be unstoppable. So where do I go now? Go to the Wyreth tomb. Uh, I'm sending you to go slay Wyreth, my dear. The exiled Prince of Darkness himself. With a royalty and giant of Niflheim. Okay. Cool. Recommend level 8. Maybe we level up a little bit before this. Well, then let's go ahead and check the other quest. Hey. Where the hell am I? Pfft. I'm geared up enough. I can handle it. It's only two levels ahead of me. Who freaking cares? Let's go. Wait, you didn't tell me it was gonna be a giant golem? Uh. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. How do I get out? Am I supposed to go into the circle that, that creates when they die? Nope. Oh my god, it's never ending! Is this it? Is this just how I die? There has to be something I'm missing. How do I get out of here? I'm dead. I'm just dead. It's just such little damage compared to this. What the hell? Yeah, okay. I don't know what the hell was happening there. I just couldn't escape that. Poor soul, you must be lost. Let your quest journal guide you. I fucking did. Oh, this does unlock new stuff. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, there's a lot to look at. Let me at least run this once and see how I feel about it. Let's see, what level do you- Alright, uh, so as I was saying, I'm gonna go run the other dungeon, um, just a few times. Perfect, so now everything's got an extra 5%, yeah, or 5 HP, which is absolutely massive. I like the ability on it, I just don't like the fact that it takes so many, like, hits to kill him. Like, why wouldn't I just go all-out damage, right? There is the Templar Sword, which takes both of those ingredients, and I can actually preview it. It just does straight-up 16 damage. Gives 50% critical hit chance and 25% more critical hit damage for 8 seconds while holding the Templar Sword. Wait, that sounds a lot better. I mean, not really. Right? Increases the damage of critical hits by 100%. Wait, I, oh, dude. Do I farm that up, like, right now? That sword could be fucking insane if I want to do a crit build. And with this armor, I think a crit build is very viable. Uh, you're in my ass! Stop being in my ass! Where are you pushing me to? this guy? What the hell? How are you chill with this guy, but I'm the problem? 
Do you think it's possible to double crit? Like, if I jump... Just did se oh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and say yes, seeing as I just did 71 damage on crit. Beautiful. Oh, man. Uh, 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 never mind. They figured out how to get around it. I'm not leaving here without two more cast iron, you fiends. Just give me that sweet, sweet cast iron already. Okay, so I lose out on max mana, which I just now realized. Wait, doesn't that go against... Doesn't this use mana? Cost 10 mana. Fuck, dude. 38. 38, okay. If I take off my helmet, right? Not full set. 35. Are you fucking kidding me? This set is a scam. This set is just a straight up fucking scam. So I need 15 of this cast iron and I can make the sword. Now that's the part of the build that's going to be insane, I think. Oh, I have enough. I was just like mindlessly farming them, not even realizing that I was at enough. Holy shit. I really hope that this crit build is good and not ass or I'm going to be very sad. I right click with it. And then I just start beating people up for 12, or for how long? I don't actually know, for 8 seconds, I get a plus 50% critical hit chance, and 25% more damage. First of all, let me see how much damage I do on a crit, I want to double check that. So a crit does 40. Wait, that's, that's fucking insane, dude. Now I'm dealing 60 on a crit. And I can basically spam it, it's like a 4 second cooldown after my thing runs out. I might not have a high crit chance, or any kind of crit chance at all, from wearing it, like you can actually see, my crit chance is a, is a fat frickin' zero. 45, like it does 5 extra damage. Yeah, not enough mana, and I can't do anything about that, right? Well, I'm glad I at least made the gear, it's pretty sick gear, it's just not that good. There's probably other stuff in here that I want to make uh, down the line, such as the shiny necklace, which I can actually go ahead and make. Wait, what? 20 plus HP from that, 5 from this. I can make more of these and farm them up, which I probably will do next time a little bit just to get more HP and everything. But maybe not. Maybe I'll wait until I hit a wall and then I'll worry about farming stuff up. But that is it for this one, Mine Ward W server. I can't wait to check more of it out. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you didn't, you haven't yet. Join the server. All the information down in the description. Leave a like on this video. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys in the next one.